Hi, I'm Dr. Ramsey Amin, RevMcDentalImplants.com. I want to show a special case, a custom subperiosteal dental implant. Most people have never seen one of these before, uh, so here's your chance to look at it before it goes in tomorrow. So what these look like is like so. This is when it's all put together before it goes into the patient. And a subperiosteal implant is a custom implant that goes on top of the bone. It's this custom metal frame that has teeth on it. And this patient's jaw is very, very thin. This is a 3D printed lower jaw. And you can see the patient's jaw is thinner than my pinky. So you can't drill implants into this jaw or the jaw will break. This is also some nerve chambers where the teeth, where the nerves come out from. So the way this is custom made out of titanium, a very, very special process. And I'm going to show how this piece comes off. Okay, so this is the actual subperiosteal implant. Custom made milled titanium. The, the gums are opened and this is placed inside the mouth. Inside through the gums and it sits on three areas right here. And once that's seated on the bone, it fits like a like like nesting, like taco shells would sit on top of each other or cups would stack. And the screws, the screw holes just help it all hold in. Then once it's done, the teeth go on on the same day and they just go on just like so. There's some hidden screws that hold it all in. This is not removable by the patient. But this is a custom subperiosteal dental implant, very one of a kind, made for the patient, typically done on the lower jaw. They're typically not recommended on the upper jaw. And this is uh, Dr. Amin, Ramsey Amin. I'm Burbank, California, and I'll post this. So if there's any questions, please let me know. Thanks so much. Bye.